Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Major Cliche Plays Prey. Alright. We gotta go and... Talk to our brother now. Oh. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Not dealing with you, Weaver. Jesus. Okay, come on, just run, just run, just run, just run. Just run. Just run. We're not dealing with any of you guys. <laughs> That's not happening right now. We got other things to do. So we gotta go back up to the Arboretum to talk to our brother, and then we can also kill the cook for Danielle and fulfill that other side mission since the crew quarters is right up there with our brother's office, so... Where has he been hiding out? That's another good question. What has he been doing this entire time? Because we went up to his office. He wasn't there. Made it to your office, Morgan. I haven't been here since... I believe it was the time where your medical condition was discussed, Chief Engineer Lucian. What the hell? Morgan, is that... I am January. Morgan Yu's personal operator. Talk about loving the sound of your own voice. All right, January. Is that Morgan's workstation? And the fabricator? Morgan, come up here when you get a chance. Chief Ilyushin, please do not... Oh. Maybe, maybe we should talk to Mikhaila first. That, uh... All right. Yeah, let's let's go to the lobby first and talk to Mikaela. Please don't let the entire lobby be infested. Oh, that looks wonderful. Quickly, quickly, quickly. Run, 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 run. As everything is going crazy all around the station. How did she make it up here when she's got no frickin' weapons? And Morgan... Morgan, hope you don't mind. I was using your workstation. Chief Ilyushin ignored my request to desist 13 times. Good! You no need to tell Morgan about the 14th time, January. I took the liberty of restocking your supplies. Found some food on the way up, left it on the desk. Don't worry, they're alien-proof. I checked them, no twitching. Chief Ilyushin is correct. There are no Typhon Cacoplasmas present. Oh, thank you, January. Uh, just dump all the trash. We pick up anything extra that we don't want? I don't think so. I haven't been in here since you were lecturing me on my paraplexus. Oh, for sure you were going to fire me. Too bad you were sweet on me. I could tell. I never told you why I altered my medical records. I know you were so sure when you were lecturing me, Morgan, saying I was selfish and... <clears throat> My father, he was imprisoned for questioning the Soviet intervention in India. Many prisoners are lost in Siberian labor camps, but my father vanished. The only thing I knew for certain was Tronstar was recruiting volunteers from those labor camps. I came here because of you. And Alex, and your experiments. He was sent here. I'm sure of it. The work in the Neuromod division, in Psychotronics. I was hoping to gain access, but there was no way in. Nothing to trace the volunteers who come and go. Tronstar is very... thorough. I know you have... forgotten things, but if you find some evidence of my father, it would set my mind at peace. Oh, really? That's that's all you gotta say to us? Search the cargo bay for the secret crate where Quentin... Morgan. Yes? Just like you to keep me waiting. Oh, oh okay. Expecting me to have an answer for you right now. Psh. 
All right. Upload, upgrade that. Is there is there a neuro mod that we can extend our shield? Is that a thing we can do? We can always make food better, but I think we're getting towards the end. I don't know if it's worth making food better. Uh, impact calorie, reduce stamina cost of wrench attacks. Uh, combat focus. Still haven't used that one. Enter a state of combat focus for 10 seconds in which time slows around. Eh. 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 Because I would love it if we could make our shields better. Yeah, the regen one, telepathy. Yeah, we really haven't messed around with those at all. Huh. Well, can we even make any neuromods? Yes, we can. We could make one, right? Yeah, we could make one. Or we can make more shotgun shells. And shotgun-wise, we've got... 29. Yeah, let's make let's make some bullets. Cuz we don't have other shells right now. All right. So we got to go back up to the arboretum. Our office is sealed up. Ah. So we can't go running through. And what did what did uh what did Mikayla wanted us to do? It was whistleblower for Quentin Per search the cargo. Yeah, because I already found a whole bunch of these things. Search the cargo bay. You on map where. I gotta go all the way back down there. You could have done that over the radio. Could have told me about this on the radio. <coughs> <coughs> oh, sorry about that. So I would have to go back down to the cargo bay and find the pod that Quentin was hiding in. Uh, I like you, Michaela, but. I mean, these are airlocks. We still have an open shuttle bay and psychotronics. They each have airlocks in them. Or we could go do that. Or we could go up to the Arboretum. And then from the Arboretum, we could go down, back down to the cargo bay if we wanted to. And help out Michaela. Uh... Yeah, I think we're just going to go talk to our brother now. Hi. Don't feel like dealing with you. It was nice seeing you. Not really. Up to the Arboretum. We can kill the cook for Danielle. We can do, we can do one nice side thing. And then we'll worry about Michaela's dad later. Who's probably dead. Who knows? Probably. More than likely. People don't seem to last that long around here. Unless the... Unless the cook is her father. At which point... Her dad's not a very nice person. Because he killed Danielle's girlfriend. Which point... Dad's a murderer. And I'd kind of be okay with him dying. Because Danielle was nice. She helped us out. But then again, we apparently have the hots for Michaela. I don't really know why. Then again, neither does Morgan right now. I'm sending you the code to my graph shaft. Assuming it still works. Oh good, then I don't have to parkour up to you. Ah oh, crap. Ah oh, crap. Yeah.
Reload. Oh, come on! Alright, we should probably do stamina. Oh, that's irritating. Yeah, there's still nothing here. Grab the flowers. Grab the flowers. Why do we keep getting the boom, 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 boom? Oh, great. We got angry robots. Welcome. Maybe I can help you. Alright, screw this. Just kill them. Where are you? You said that you could help me. There are a lot of vegetables in here. And a lot of crazy psychotic people. And a weaver. I kind of want to go in there. Let's hack it. Let's just do it. Come on. And we got it. Activate sprinklers. What is that going to do? Is that going to make you guys go crazy? Apparently the telepath don't like that. Does that mean that it's out? Hello, are you here for an appointment? Hi, medical operator. Fix me. God damn it. System alert. Repairs needed. Please contact a qualified engineer. Okay, yes, I should really do repairs. Where did the telepath go? System alert. Repairs needed. Please contact a qualified engineer. Wait, really? A shotgun doesn't do anything against people. Oh, come on! Their heads still explode and they still kill me. Come on. Do we get reloaded back in here, or...? Where, where are we gonna be? Where are we gonna be? Oh, all the way back here. I'm sending you the code to my graph shaft. Assuming it still works. Ugh. Okay. Got him. Right, greenhouse. Hello, are you here for an appointment? See, now I would very much like you to heal me. Hello, Greater Mimic. Ah. Goodbye, Greater Mimic. Oh, come on. 
waste of way too much ammo. Hello, <coughs> are you here for an appointment? No, but I'd like to be. Ah, wrong way. Come on. All right, still no problem. All right, quick save right here, yeah. And use the med kit. And... Disruptor stun gun. Activate sprinklers. Yeah. Hello, are you here for an appointment? I would very much like to get health from you. Unlock greenhouse doors. Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. Okay. Qualified engineer. God damn it. Come on. Come on, you stupid weaver. Oh, telepath, sorry. This is bullcrap! I can't reach him! They keep blowing up- okay, screw this, screw this, we're not- As nice as it would be to go into the greenhouse, screw this, I'm not wasting any more time on this. Let's just go- let's go find out what's going on with Alex. Hello, good to see you again, Dr. Yu. Yeah, 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 wasted enough health on this. And where's the cruise quarters? <laughs> Stop. Yes, that's right. Crew quarters. Oh, chef. God. If I am remembering correctly, there should be. Wait, where is there a medical operator? Good afternoon, Talos. Are you Once on the you ceiling somewhere? The cafeteria from 12 to 2 p.m. Please refer to the weekly upgrade for today's menu. You're fl you're probably flying in the ceiling somewhere. Hello, nice to see you. 
Where are you? Yep, you're flying on the ceiling. <sighs> so close. Diagnosing there superficial injuries. Nothing a portable medical kit couldn't handle. This won't take long. All done. Please fill out a patient experience oh, come on. so I can serve you better next time. Can you not? Like, what is... Diagnosing. Looks like you've had a rough day. Yeah, and I had to break you. Please fill out a patient experience questionnaire so I can serve you better next time. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's go, let's go kill this chef. And then go talk to our brother. That's that's one thing, like... They gotta fix that. Because that is horrifically irritating. They just fly to the top of the ceiling? All the frickin' time? They just bug out in certain areas with high ceilings? Because that's what I'm guessing it is. Like, they think they're on the other level, where it's like the stairs, so they think they're on the other level... But they're not, so they end up all the way on the ceiling. Oh, that went weird for a little bit. Uh, cafeteria. Hey, Sheffy! What? Oh, God damn it! there's a thermal... Reservation scanner? What? What the heck is that? You shushing. Are they like in your head or something? Please don't harm me. I certainly wait, Mr. Purvis. Wait, what? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Purvis! The skillet knows Purvis. How can I kill you? I can barely hit you, and that's just a waste of ammo. Uh, let's just. let's electrocute you. The game just crashed. Are you serious? The ga game... Game's never, ever... Wow. Wow. I don't know, like, normally I'll deal with, like, buggy things in games before, but never in a game that costs 60 bucks. Like, I've never had a problem with games being buggy or crashing or anything... If it was a game that cost more than 40 bucks, I've never, ever had a single issue any one of those games. And now, all of a sudden, Prey is just, for some odd reason, not too friendly to me. Are, are you, like, permanently crashed? You're not going to restart? Well, guys, we might have to call this episode here uh, until I can figure out what's going on and why it won't relaunch. Uh, so I guess I'll see you guys in the next episode. As always, leave a like, comment, subscribe, follow me on Twitter, and I'll see you guys in the next episode when hopefully this game decides it wants to work again. All right. <laughs>